While waiting for a shipment of virtual foundry steel filament, the thought crossed my mind. Could I cold cast steel powder in a mold that I've 3D printed on my resin printer? Instead of pondering any further, I just decided to try. I already had about a kilo of steel shavings that I already purchased for a prior attempt at something else. So the next step I took was to try and figure out a proper ratio to make a binder for this. I also wanted to use my copper putty during this project because depending on the results, this may end up helping my other projects as well. Printing was done on my Elegoo Mars and I think they came out very well. I attempted to dilute the glue here with some ethyl alcohol, but as you'll see while mixing, it didn't actually do what I intended it to, so I ended up doing a second attempt at this mix. I feel it's important to show the failures though so that people don't make the same mistakes if they want to try these projects at home. The mixture really wasn't holding together very well here, so it was probably too much alcohol or maybe the glue just needs to be added at a different step. I decided to try to mix the glue here first with the powder and then mix the alcohol. Things are already looking a little better at this point, so I'm going to continue mixing this and try another casting. After putting the pieces of the mold together, I'm then going to attach two rubber bands to try and distribute the pressure along the sides. Now we just have to wait for this to dry. This might be too much foreshadowing, but maybe I didn't wait long enough. Did I? Because that looks pretty good. Just to be sure, let's put the fan on it for a little bit longer, because the lettering will be the most difficult side to take out. Well, maybe I didn't wait long enough, but I think that the binder actually needs to be tweaked a little bit. This doesn't seem to hold together quite well enough, and the definition on the lettering isn't there. Either way, this was a fun thought experiment turned real experiment, and I hope to do more soon. Cheers.